Hey, and Unk's word, what you keeping a raggedy motherfucker? I do the gummy retarded and ride the yellow bus. Turn the car in circles until the time's bust. Yeah. Out the window like, hey, hey, cuss, cuss. On the hood of the scraper. Like Lock these wheels and deals. We back at it again with another lit video, y'all, man. I'm actually on my way to the dealer only auction. Uh, man, like I said in previous video, man, I'm starting to like Copart more. Uh, for the simple fact, I could go out there and look at some cars. Uh, I get my titles the same day I pay pay for them and pick them up. At the dealer auction, you wait in 30 days to get your title. People don't want to buy. People don't want to buy no cars without no title, so that's not gonna work. Man, there's always money calling me, man. Every time, I can't even do a video without the phone ringing. But uh, yeah, I mean, the guy is pros and cons, but man, I'm in. I'm trying to sell cars fast. You know what I mean? them and i can't even work on cars if i don't have the titles you know what i mean so i gotta sit on cars if there's something wrong with them or i want to fix them up a little bit or put some money into them and then they call me back talking about they need the car back because the big dealership trade-ins the the deal didn't go through so you know i said that in a previous video but i noticed that everyone don't watch all the videos so i had to repeat myself and say it again but yeah so and plus you stay up here all day so i can walk the yard on Monday and look at what cars I want and write my list down <clears throat> then the next day I just sit at home and bid or if I'm in traffic I could stop what I'm doing and start bidding here you gotta stay up and sit up at the dealer auction for four hours and wait for your car or whatever it depends man right now the Copart is cheaper it's cheaper to buy them at Copart I have some good luck I'm making some good money buying cars at Coport. Uh, dealer auction, man, I've been doing the dealer auction for years, so, I mean, Copart is new to me, so I guess it's fun because it's new, but, hey, and to those that's trying to get in Copart, in Oklahoma, I don't know about no other states, and y'all be asking me, uh, what's the law? Every state got different laws, but in Oklahoma, you do not need dealer license. You don't need no type of license. You don't even need a business. I mean, but should I have all that, so, but you don't need it at Copart, so, just to let y'all know if y'all want to buy a car or just flip one, you know, or if y'all just want to just buy a car for a project car just for the, you know, for the summer or whatever, and then get it together and keep it or sell it. I met a lot of people that have been watching my videos at Copart. They said they're the reason why they went to Copart. So, man, shout out to y'all guys, man. I love all the support. Oh yeah, y'all see me pulling up to the dealer only auction, man. I'm gonna see what they have up here. I'm not gonna be sitting up here. I don't have time. I gotta go pick up my Monte Carlo. I gotta finish getting my truck ready for I can sell it today. You know, I gotta get money. I don't have time to be sitting up here. And I got enough cars to make money. Right now, I just gotta get the cars I got to get them ready right now. I gotta get them ready. I got enough. I ain't gonna say I got a whole bunch. But I got enough. I got at least, see how many cars I got. I'm probably about like six right now. I right, got about six. I could buy a whole bunch more, but I'm not gonna be sitting on my money buying these cars on the dealer auction. I can't sell them. Not especially if I've been going to Copart though. You know, before yeah, I'll deal with it. But man, I've been dealing with that shit for too many years. So let's get up out of here. Drop out this thing. I love my truck, y'all. I'm glad I bought it. Everyone think it's the exact same one I already had. I bought one that looked dead on it. Dead on the one I had, and I only had that one for like five, six months. And yes, y'all, I still got these that damn rims in the back of my car, man. I'm gonna try to figure out, so I'm gonna try to have someone put them on a pallet for me. They talking about they can't ship out used rims. I'm about to wrap them up, uh, hide them or whatever, and just say they're new rims and tires. And they can't even see it. I'm gonna have them all wrapped up, ceramic wrap. Let's get up in this damn fill up. Matter of fact, let me walk through the back. No, let me walk through the front. <laughs> Don't know which way did he go, George. Which way did he go? But yeah, guys, man, I'm about to walk up in here. And I might show y'all a few cars that go through. If I see them, I'm not going to be sitting up here all day, especially if I don't see nothing. I can't sit up here all day just to make a video. I got a lot of I got a lot of things that, that needs to be done. So I'm going to try to get it. I'm going to go over here. And a lot of times I like to come up here and talk with other dealers and other people that's in the business man you know you exchange knowledge you know conversate man it's good to talk to people that's into the same type of stuff that you are if you're a car person 
Yeah, it, it feel good to talk to other car people. If you're in any type of other industry, it's good to talk to people that's into the same stuff that you're into and see different points, you know, different points of their thoughts versus your thoughts and, and all that. So that's pretty cool. So I like to come up here and politic a little bit with the other dealers and see how things are going, how they feel about tax season, uh, how they've been making good money, how they feel about the business. You know, this this regular conversation, man. So I'm gonna come up here and just show my face. I haven't been up here. Well, I've been skipping a few options because I've been so busy. I haven't been coming up here. I skipped probably what, three options? So they probably like, dang, what happened to you? Cold for treating you good over there? You got damn right. So yeah, anyways, y'all, man, it's always love over here. I made a lot of money with these guys. Oklahoma Auto Exchange, man. If y'all wanna get your dealer license, come on, this is the place, man. You get all the good trade-ins and you know, you get some good deals, but right now it's middle tax season. So I know the game, all these dealers got a lot of money. They financing, they putting cars on notes. So they're able to pay more for the cars. And you know, they'll have like a car like this and they'll sell it for like 10 grand on payments. Or probably even older than that. They'll take a little uh, uh, Grand Am and sell it for five grand on payments. Take the little Cavalier, you paying like three grand for that little Cavalier on payment, you know what I mean? So that's kind of the, the game they playing and there's a lot of them taking over. Everyone's going to payment. I'm a cash only type of guy. So, hey, we playing different games. So I got to get in where I fit in. But anyways, guys, I'm about to get up in here and see what we can find. We up here, y'all.
Let's see how much it's gonna go for, y'all. Let's see. I'm I'm curious myself. Sports sold for 12.4, 12,400, man, just because y'all need to know. But man, y'all comment below, let me know, was that a good deal, man? Oh boy, saying that something wrong with the reverse. Let me see, can I walk out here and, and get a good walk around of it? Where did he go? Let me go find it, man. I'm gonna try to find this thing. But uh, man, I think, I don't know, it might be, it might be a good deal if it's a good car. I didn't even pay attention, was it a yellow, green, or red light? But well, anyways, man, y'all comment below and let me know because I think it's a good deal for uh, Grand Sport. I hear the damn car over there. There y'all go, all cammed up. Y'all like the cam sound. Y'all hear it? You want to get out of here? Yeah. I you know you like this well, thing. Back, I can't get out, man. You can't get out? Oh, you mean the door? Yeah. I thought you meant the car, oh, man. Oh, the button right here. <laughs> yeah, I, I draw the How you keep it running? I'm going to walk around it real quick. Man, this thing is nice, sexy, beautiful, and gorgeous. Yeah. Oh, nothing. Broke into it to, yeah. to, to turn the lights off. Yeah. Never had to figure out how to get those things Oh, you on. never got them so off? they stayed on. That's what drained the battery. Oh. Now, the first time or two we drove it, there's no problem. Some dealers came up with Jack with it, and then all of a sudden, oh, okay. these lights won't go off. They won't go off? And that's what killed it. Oh, but okay. the locking part, man, I don't know. Yeah. Rock's got some practice, though. He had to break that thing like four times. Oh, yeah? Since last night. Oh, he's professional now. Okay. Nah. Well, y'all see it, man. It's a beautiful ass car, man. It's sexy. It sounds good. Well, y'all see it. They're looking good, they're looking right. Huh? 14, 4? Or 15, 4? I don't know. I didn't pay attention. Man, look at the wheels, man. Y'all see it, man. This thing is sexy. I like that color. How much it go for? Uh, 14, I'm, I think 15, four. Dang, man. Yeah. It's the Grand Sport. Yeah, it's a Grand Sport. It got the whole body kit, like it's ready for the track. It's wide, it got the wide body. Man, that thing looks sexy, man. Well, yeah, guys, man, we on to the next, man. I'm gonna pat this goddamn watch, man. Already? <laughs> I'm out this goddamn thing, man. We on to the next, we on to the next. And now we're over here at Copart, man. I had to leave the dealer option early, man, cause I got stuff to do. But y'all see it, man. I got my Copart. I got another build, y'all. So there's no fender damage on here. As far as that, it's hit center. There's no damage right here at all. This, so they basically gonna have to cut this out and take this off. I'm not doing the work. I'm sending straight to mechanics. But yeah, y'all see it, man. I think I'm gonna make some good money on this one. Let me climb over to the other seat, y'all. Don't wanna get glass in my ass. Man, let me get over here. <laughs> the grind is so real, y'all. The grind is so real. What's that, bullet shells? Uh-huh. Dropping this straight off to mechanic shop. So I'm about to go get Melly right now. I'm solo. This. No copyrighted man. Turn this shit off. Alright, so I got that off, that off. I'm gonna leave this car here for a few minutes. Go get Melly. Climb up out of this 
God dang. So I drove out. Man, I think I did pretty good, man. I'm happy I got it. Man, I'm loving it, man. Buying cars at Cofort, man. I already got my title. Uh, I'm about to go turn it in. It's Savage, turn it in. Rebuilt. Love selling cars in Oklahoma. So easy and smooth. Don't got to do. You get the titles back. You turn. I'll turn the title today. I'll get it back in three days. Bam. I don't know if the car going to be ready in three days, but shit, it'll be able to be sold. I'm back up in my black truck. Y'all see it. Big Bertha. I'm back up in Big Bertha, y'all. Where my damn keys at, man? So I'm going to go pick up Miller. I'm going to go grab something to eat. In the meanwhile, so the grind don't stop, man. I still got to get that truck ready. So, and then to Sean's, money making Sean's. Camaro was on the flat. So he was on a mission to get that. I was like, man, I got stuff to do. I can't babysit you. So he went to go look for a tire. I guess he got his tire for his Camaro. His little cheap self. I guess he gets it from me, but he tried to be cheap and Man, can I just patch it? I like, man, that tire gone. Go get you a new tire, man. You gonna keep having problems with this tire? I was like, is this better right now? You lucky is that at home on the flat? So he got that fixed, so that's good. So he missed out on school because tire shops don't open. Now I'm not dropping them off and picking them up. So hey, it is what it is. But yeah, guys, I'll see y'all when I get back into the car i know melly she ain't gonna drive that car so most likely i'm gonna be driving that car back to the uh well not back but to the mechanic shop we pulling back up to co park what's up melly what's up you guys what it do so y'all see the, right there that busted up ass oh my good lord look <laughs> oh shit <laughs> I need you to come look at it though. Because you ain't gonna see it like this next time you see it. I just looked at it. I want you to, no, I want you to get out the car and look at it. Yeah. Look at it, probably. But like that, damn. No, it drives real good though. Look. I think this is the need of a $2.99 special make uh, make a paint All job. Right. It don't need no paint job. Where it need paint job? Right here. You know. Where? That's dust. That's dirt. No, oh, not, is, you know, clear coat. Man, it's tax season. Off. They gonna buy it like that. It ain't faded it. that bad. Wait, look at this. Maybe Paul could hook us up for about fifty more dollars and fix the door. Hey, and Unks worry. What you keeping the raggedy motherfucker? <laughs> what you about to keep the? Yo, know, Unks, we said, what you about to keep the? See, look, it only hit right there. Look, the fender's not hit. Okay, look, you guys. He said, look. This is not dent, dent it or ain't hold nothing on, dent. Hold on, let me get this Go real ahead. quick. He said it's only hit right here. This motherfucker is caved the fuck in, okay? No. <laughs> it's still open, but. Alright, I'll open. I gotta crawl in there. <laughs> it ain't gonna be like that next time. Y'all make sure y'all stay tuned. <laughs> you know I gotta talk my shit. <laughs> You gotta, uh, you know I'm gonna get this shit ready. <laughs> you, know. you know, I gotta talk, I gotta you look, guys. Look, man, I didn't want her to feel sorry for me, though. But look, I got glass that I gotta sit my ass in. Damn, yeah. look. Yeah, I'm about to sit all in the glass. So while you in your little comfortable car. You know what? I don't care what nobody say. Anybody that. <laughs> what a crime, man. <laughs> we got to go, man. You gotta go. You gotta go. You gotta go. Oh. But yeah, man, I see y'all. Huh? Oh, yeah, I got it. I'm about to head up and go. I don't even know how much gas is in this car. Because the gauge don't work. I don't know. Probably stop at the gas station if I find one. Hopefully, I don't run out of gas. Y'all, man, y'all pray for me, man. Yeah, that car was caught on fire. Somebody was mad. Let's see. Oh yeah, guys, I'm gonna have to put some gas in here. No gauge don't work. Car drive's good though. Oh, this other window down. All right, y'all, I'm on my way to mechanic shop. Man, I'm 
man, this thing is smashing, y'all. Oh, this thing drives excellent. It drives really good. But man, I hope it don't cost that much to get this door fixed. And then I gotta get another cluster for this car. And none of the gauges are working, none of them. I just got done dropping this car off. I'm about to hop back in the car with Melly over here. My, my getaway driver, now you could drive. Sure. I'm positive. My getaway driver. I don't want your ass to drive anyway. Nah. I'm just trying to be nice. Trying to be nice. Now you want to be nice. Mm -hmm. Now that I'm feeling better. That she's feeling better, y'all. Y'all see it? She's she been sick for a minute. But y'all, man. I gotta get that truck ready. So yeah, man. Let's... I can't believe he's trying to get rid of Old Faithful. Hey, man. Old Faithful been around us for a whole year, you guys. I know, right? That's the longest I ever kept the uh, car that wasn't was mine, but not really mine. Yeah, the man. company's truck. Exactly. It's still gonna be the company's truck. So I'm over here at Walmart. I got my floor mats. That's my starter kit. I got me a um, steering wheel cover. It's on this, so I'm about to put these floor mats in there. Uh, if it wasn't tax season and the cars wasn't selling that fast, what I usually do is spray paint in here all black, especially in the truck where y'all see all that brown at. I'll turn all that into black, but man, people ain't tripping like that around this season. People just want the car or the truck, and they want it now, so I got to hurry up and just put it out there. And, uh, man, it runs good. Like I said, this was my personal work truck. Up. Old Faithful crank up every time, even when I don't drive. I never had to jump this car, and I don't even drive it like that. So, yeah. So I gotta get my pictures in. I'm about to put these floor mats in. Put the steering wheel cover on. Yeah. Good old work truck, man. This thing stays smashed. Running good. Do a little walk around for y'all, for y'all can see it. How, how I cleaned it up. We're gonna see how the motor looks. I'm gonna show y'all all that. Finally done with the truck. Y'all see it. I'm gonna do a little walk around for y'all. It's not a bad looking truck. Could use some paint, but man, it's a work truck. Who cares about looks? You know what I mean? That was funny. Yesterday I did a video of the Impala. As soon as I got done making the video, I end up selling the uh, Impala. So by the time I get the posted, by the time I got finished with the, making the video, let alone a week later, I post a video a week late, the car's already sold. So, hey, so just hit me up, man. If y'all don't see it on IG, Lucky Bulls and Deals on IG, then, hey, it's not for sold. It's it been either sold or for some reason it's not posted because I'm not selling it. So. Whatever I got for sale, I'm going to post it on IG. But yeah, y'all see it, man. Let me go ahead, open this up. It's all clean inside. Got the floor mats in there. Let me start this bad boy up. Got 150,000 miles on it. All these windows down. Drop them. Pop the head one time. Y'all see it? Got the 5.3 Vortec motor. Y'all see it? right there V8 open up this side so it got three doors this door opens up and then this open up this handle broke right here y'all so but I don't ever ride with nobody but it's cool if you want to so it's wide open That's crazy y'all man i was just thinking to myself while driving over here i was like man i give a lot of game a lot of knowledge y'all and no i don't feel threatened man because man you gotta have good work ethic to, to do what i do 
Like, man, the grind don't stop, man. I be tired, I be worn out. I am not going to lie to y'all, man. I be worn out. Tired, sleepy. I think I'm pretty much done for today. Uh, hopefully I sell this car, I mean this truck. I'm gonna try to edit some videos. I'm about to try to drop some videos if I can catch up, man. My memory's running low. I got, let's see how many hours I got. Damn, I don't got no hours. I got 16 minutes left on my memory card, man. I'm like running thin, so I gotta start dropping them, dropping them back to back. I gotta probably spend one day just editing videos and just dropping them. So, man, but it's a nice day. It's grinding season, man. I'm trying to show y'all everything I do as far as getting cars ready, selling them, and and uh buying them and everything man so man uh if to save memory and not record for a few days to say just to save memory to catch up that mean i don't have to, that mean i'm not going to be recording but what i might do i might just buy another memory card and because the grind don't stop you already know man i appreciate the whole lucky nation thank you for all the support man if y'all interested in buying any hoodies any uh t-shirts man i got the monte carlo logo i got the old logos ready i mean whatever logo y'all see that i have of all my shirts that y'all see i got this logo if y'all want this logo holla at me man i got all i got like probably like five six different logos got the monte carlo and the corvette that's the main hot ones right now i still haven't got my personal one made yet it should be ready man i gotta go holla at letter express to see is mine i put my order in for my own stuff you feel me but yeah, guys, man, just like that, this video's over. Make sure you guys like, share, comment, subscribe. Lucky's Woods and Dills, and I'm out. Yay! If I break it down the door, not a store key. Got a bitch to cool me down up in the booth, because I'm my over here. I can't believe it took me these views for you to notice me. I can't believe it.